Edith LeBain here at Cage Warriors 105. I am here with Mick Stanton, who just executed a perfect game plan. This is not normally what we see from you. We normally see you throwing those heavy shots. Was it your game plan coming into this fight? To take it to the ground and control it on the ground? Definitely, yes. You know, moved up to middleweight now and they're a lot bigger. They're a lot stronger, so I've, I've had to adapt and, you know, I've got to use my wrestling. Um, put him on his back and beat him up. He was a lot taller, so that was the game plan that worked well. So trying to avoid the reach advantage as well? Definitely, yes, definitely. They're not much okay. bigger on the floor then. <laughs> and do you feel like this is a good weight, weight class for you? I do, yes. Um, I, was, I was having silly cuts to make 12 stone at welterweight and I feel a lot better than middleweight. I feel fitter and stronger. Um, obviously, I've just got to keep developing and getting, getting bigger and getting faster and getting stronger. And how do you like finding outside of Liverpool? I love it. I love it. It's nice to travel about and Cage Warriors is such a big show. It's nice to see other parts of the country. And I heard there's been some talks between you and Eunice, maybe online, to fight. But I just heard you calling James Webb. So what's the story behind that? Let's you know, see where I am at the moment. I, want, I did want to fight Eunice tonight. But from unfortunately, you know, I've just had a win. He's still 2-0. So what's the point in going backwards? I want that title now. You know, show me you've got a beat or, you know, I'll jump in and fight Webb anytime. Well, I was actually going to ask you, since there's going to be this big fight June 29th, Night of Champions, I'm guessing you're going to be watching, right? Of course, yeah. I might just stay ready just in case you never know what, what might can happen. Well, I wanted to know your prediction between James and Frederick, yeah. but now obviously you want James to win and then you well, want to go after his belt. Yes, Is that the plan? Know, I'm a, I've sparred Frederick a few weeks ago and know him well. You know, he's a very tough lad. He's got dynamite in his hands and, and he's got great kicks and he's got superb ground game, so it's going to be a very close fight. At the moment, Webb's the champion. And it can happen. You know, I just want that belt. Well, it was great to see a different version of you. You did amazing tonight. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Thank you for having me.